my daughter had been invited to a birthday party. She had been in a bouncy castle and had fallen, and the paramedics were called. It was determined that she had a severe break. They gave her a dose of morphine upon transfer over to the hospital, and upon arriving at the hospital to help her manage pain a little more and maybe help her get some more rest, they gave her a dose of fentanyl, another strong medication. It did make us have a little bit of fear that she was given two strong medications all at once, being that she is so little. We got wheeled into the room and shortly after the surgeon came in to discuss the upcoming procedure and operation and I really wish he had taken me to the side because it just instilled more fear in her and I think it actually made her pain a little worse. She had a four hour surgery late that evening and she had to have three pins put in her arm. What I didn't know is how lucky we were to have paramedics who have given Cadence the medicine that they did on the transfer to the hospital. If it hadn't been managed as well in the beginning, that it could have made her more susceptible to further pain in the future. When it comes to pain management, it's not just all about the medication I found. It's also a great tool is distraction when her pain medication was wearing off and she's sobbing and sobbing. I reached out to an emergency doctor and I asked him if they had just a teddy bear on hand that she could just squeeze, so he brought her that. I just hope that you can learn from my family's painful experience that you are your child's biggest advocate. So if your child is in pain and you want to know if they can have more medication or if there's anything more you can do, don't be intimidated about being in an emergency room. Reach out to the doctors and the nurses. I know they're rushing around, but just ask. Just stop them and ask because it doesn't have to hurt.